Hi, this is Robertson from Pour One Malt doing another lightning fast review. Now today I'm doing Ben Romick, which is a Speyside distillery founded in 1898. The one I'm doing today is the Ben Romick Vintage 2012 Batch 3. This one comes in at 59.6%. Let's get in the glass. Okay. All right, on the nose, I get cinnamon apples, gingerbread, a bit of marzipan. There's a, there's a little bit of an earthy peat note, plums, raisins, wet leaves, a bit of honey. On the palate. Okay, the peat hits me first. It's an earthy peat, not a medicinal peat. There's wet wood, wet leaves. It's quite autumnal. This one's like walking in a forest after a rain. Cooked vegetables. I'm getting a bit of cinnamon, clove, black pepper. Cooked apples, dried uh, like sage, a, maybe a bay leaf in there. There's a biscuit note, cinnamon biscuits with almond. There's also this machine engine oil sort of note. And a, like a gunpowder or a firework note and a bit of cigar ash in there. Now, as it's finishing, as it's drying, the oak's still there. It's quite a dry oak. I've got cinnamon. I've got clove. I've still got that earthy peat. It's still quite autumnal. There's a leather note, a cigar note. And still, I've got this sulfury sort of uh, matches fireworks taste, as well as a bit of an engine oil. I think th this would probably go really, really good with a cigar. Um, now, 59.6. I did add a couple of drops of water to open this one up. Uh, it tastes like it was made in Campbelltown, but it's a Speyside. So enjoy. Slash your